everyone, Crystal here, and we are here doing a soap. I am doing my black raspberry vanilla. Um, I went to the flea market this weekend, and from the past two weekends that I've went, I have completely sold out of my black raspberry vanilla, my sangria punch, and my blackberry scone. So I am going to be doing those in the next few days so I can get them restocked. Uh, I want to do a little bit of a different design on this black raspberry vanilla than I did the other the last time I did it. I don't think I videotaped it. I'm not sure, but um, I want to do a tiger stripe this time, and then I'm going to be piping on top. Last time I didn't pipe, so this time I'm going to. And I haven't done a tiger stripe in a really long time, so I want to do that. And um, yeah, so the colors we're doing today. Let me see if I can show you here. We have black, and then I have Voodoo Pink from Mad Oils, which I am all out of now, which depresses me because I love it. And then Orchid Purple from Nurture Soap. What, bud? Okay. Um, I absolutely love these colors. And the last time I did it, I only did pink and black. So I'm adding purple this time. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's get our uh, cream in there. No coconut milk this time, just cream. I'm out of coconut milk. I need to go get some more. But I do have cream, so we're just using cream. So let's go ahead and get that buzzed up. All right, our cream is good and incorporated. Let's move that to the side there. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and add my lye, but I'm not gonna add my fragrance because I, I don't want this to be so thin to where I can't do the tiger stripe, but I don't want it to be so thick that I can't do it either. So I'm just gonna add my fragrance after I do my colors. So I'm just going to go ahead and add my silk in my lye and my sodium lactate. And then I'm going to rinse this out. You guys know what I do. Alright, so let's go ahead and get this buzzed up. I'm going to add my super fat and my glycerin, and I forgot to get my glycerin out here. I always add glycerin to my soaps. It's a humectant. It draws moisture to the skin, and it's just really good for you. So there is my glycerin. Now in with my mango butter. The mango butter will add to the conditioning of the soap and the hardness. I like to add my extra super fat with mango butter. I already have shea butter and cocoa butter in here, so now I got some mango butter. Just trying to get it all out here. Alright. Let's give that a buzz. Just going to emulsification here. All right, now I need to weigh out my topping and my bottom, and my scales got something on it here. Oh well, it'll be all right. All right, I'm going to weigh out my topping first, and I'll probably just fast forward all this. It's boring. I usually fast forward it anyway. Okay. 
So now in with our fragrance. Some here, no. there. Son of a! <laughs> hey, we don't say that. It just hurts. It hurts. Can't just help me. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do I'm going to mix this up by hand. I'm not going to use the stick blender. I might stick blend it a little bit to thicken it up just a tiny bit. Because this is kind of really loose. I didn't do no anything for my topping. See what happens when I don't um, think when I don't put the fragrance in ahead of time. Darn it! It's all right. It'll be okay. Bottom will be just be extra smelly. <laughs> can't believe I forgot to put it in my topping. Okay, so let's go ahead and stick blend this just a minute. different guys than a tiger strike because this is awful loose. colors up with my topping so let me do that really quick I can't believe I forgot to save some fragrance for my viping see what happens when I do stuff out of my routine it always happens I do stuff out of my routine I'm used to putting my fragrance in ahead of time and I don't do it the first time and I forget that's how forgetful I am. That's why I do my fragrance when I first make my soap. Instead of pouring it in with the colors. Because I'll forget. What, buddy? Yes. So there's the black. And the pink. I got Oh, come on. This better be enough pink. It's not going to be enough. gonna be a light pink. It's not as dark as I'd like it, but wait a minute. 
using Hollywood pink? No, I'm not using Hollywood pink. Okay, so there's our piping. Let's go ahead and let that set up. And I need to stir that. Okay. All right, guys, I think we're going to do a change of plans. I'm not sure. I think it's a little bit too loose for a tiger swirl. So let's go for a drop swirl, shall we? I think a drop swirl would look pretty. Can you guys see? Yeah, you can see. So I'm going to put about, oh, I don't know, a third of this in the bottom. Is that white? Yep, it's white. And then we're going to drop swirl the pink and the purple and the black. So let's start up here. Pink. Will you please stop? And the purple. Now, that will look probably good. I think it'll look good. And black. Give it a tap. Said, hey, don't move that. Move it back, please. Move it back, please. Not that far back, buddy. Wait a minute, there's a shadow here. Let me do it. You shouldn't have moved it. There we go. One more tap. Let me take these off. Ooh. It about went my soap. And then what would you? All right, let's tap it down. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. I love black raspberry vanilla. We are at the very tippy top. Seems like mm -hmm. this end is fuller than this end. And I want to scrape this. Get everything out. Who's going to wash them? I will. The lock looks a little pretty. That is full. I don't even know if we're going to get all of it in there, guys. It's a little full. Yeah, it's Yeah, full. that's full. That is it. Okay, that's all I'm going to put in the bottom because it's really full. Tap it down one more time. Don't want it to overfill. All right, let me clean it up here. And then I'll just add what's ever left of my other containers. I'll put it in the toppings. These all add them together except for the white we have a little bit more white maybe I can get just a tiny bit more in there oh nope don't overflow on me when you edit your videos do you X out our voices no bud I don't really X out anything unless I goof up and all right, that is it. I, that is about all I can do. Got the rest of the white in there. All right, guys, so I am going to... I'm going to scrape these uh, containers into my type... My typing, listen to me. My piping, and then uh, go get my piping bags, and we'll be back. So be right back, guys. Guys, we are back. And you know what? I almost was not able to pipe. 
I went to go in my sewing room and I had one piping bag left. One. And it was the big one. Um, I have two sizes. I got a 12 inch and a 16 inch. And um, I have one piping bag. So all of my piping is in this one humongous bag. They can't see. Yeah, they can. Yeah, they can see. Uh, it's all in this bag, and the only choice I had to do was to put all three colors in on top of each other. So, I've already tried, if you guys can see, can you see that? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I've already tried to pipe a little bit. Um, when I tried it up here, it just wasn't ready. Now, it's still not really ready, but it's holding its shape better than what it was. It's not running out the other end. So what I plan on doing, since they're on top of each other, is going row by row by row. And I'm hoping it'll go from one color to the next to the next. So it'll still be mixed up. Uh, I really don't want like all, all the color on this end, in the middle, and then like that. But if I do it row by row, I'm thinking maybe, just maybe, I'll be able to kind of let it go from one color to the next. Yeah! So, uh, I'm going to go ahead and get started. Boom, oh, boom. He wants me to put these sugar pearls on there. So. Then a little bit of glitter. I already put glitter on it. A little bit. Mm. I don't need no more glitter. Yes, I want this. Mommy, I want this too. Candy crumbles. That's the already the glitter that's on there, bud. Or honey. Can I eat some candle crumble? No, it's not to eat. It's for yeah. soaps. What? It's for soaps. I want that. Put some, put some of those on here, too. Yeah, Mom. Put some candy crumble. No. Put some candy crumble. No, it won't match. Yeah, it will. Come on, girl. It won't. Come on, girl. You don't know I want to eat candy. It's not candy, Elena. What is it? It's for soaps. We used to eat it. That was you are so. What? Why won't you just sprinkle it on there? That's for killing me. Oh, and that's for Nelson. Oh, and that's for Bart. All right, I think that's enough. Trying to make the top the top look pretty because it's ugly. But hopefully the drop swirl that's in the middle will look good. So here we are. Here is the topping. You can see the piping more if I put it that way. Alright guys, I want to thank you for joining me today. So stay tuned for the cut.
we crystal here and we are back to cut our black raspberry vanilla and it's still soft I used full water with this here's the top and look what I've done to one end of it if you can see that um, it was so hard to get out of the silicone mold I used full water with it this time thinking that it would help uh, help it not thicken up and it's just made it extremely soft I can't believe I used to actually soap with full water all the time now that I've done water discounts I don't want to go back to full water so I should have did a discount with this one but I didn't so let's go ahead and try to chop that end piece off here there's one end piece and it looks like it still needs a little bit of chopping to get it straight there we go that's a little bit better so we're going to go ahead and cut it I'm hoping that with using full water it doesn't take um, a lot longer to cure because I sold out of my black raspberry vanilla when I went to the flea market and I didn't realize it was going to be so popular but it was so let's go ahead and get this cut and I did a drop swirl with this that end I'll have to cut that into samples but look what I did uh, that is from me trying to push it out of the the mold uh, or the wooden mold and getting it out of the silicone so I'm either gonna have to bevel it or I'm gonna have to just um, uh, cut it up into samples but I'm trying to um, get that piece straightened out but as you can see right there too but I'm really liking the swirls that I'm seeing so far and oh my gosh it smells so good I love black raspberry vanilla it's my favorite and my daughter's favorite absolutely adore it, it smells so good so we did a drop swirl so here we go there's the first piece loving it and there's the top I wanted to, when I originally started, can you turn the water off please? Um, when I originally started I wanted to do a tiger stripe, but uh, it was too thin to do a tiger stripe so I just did a drop swirl and it looks pretty. And my kids wanted me to put the sugar pearls on top so I did. My daughter is giving me a hard time today and she's pushing my buttons of course teenagers are like that they'll push your buttons but she's really pushing my buttons today driving me nuts I'm really liking these drop swirls I think it's pretty so even though I didn't get to do my tiger stripe it still looks good I just wish I didn't use full water. I'm just so used to using a discount. I'm not used to my soaps being this soft. And I use sodium lactate, so I'm definitely not used to them being this soft. I just hope it don't take longer than what it should for the water to cure out. That's what I'm hoping anyways. You can see back here, I got my lye ready for... Um, my next soap, which is another one I sold out of, is my Blackberry Scone. So I'm going to redo that one. It's so pretty. I love the purple and black and the pink together. I think it looks good. definitely like in the drop swirl it's been a while since I've been able to do just like a regular drop swirl oops my cord got in the way there and then when I went to go pipe it I found out I only had one piping bag so my topping kind of ran together yeah. 
Ooh, that's pretty. It's a little cut right there. Last piece. And the end piece. All right, guys. So that was the making and cutting of the black raspberry vanilla. I want to thank you for joining me today. If you like this video, please do subscribe and hit the like button. Um, when you subscribe, you'll get my latest videos. I try to put out at least one or two a week. But yeah, so until next time, guys. Bye-bye.